Welcome guys, today we will talk about 3.0 update, which will be coming soon in PUBG Mobile and BGMI, there will be a lots of changes this time, the first change that will be seen is in the server, now there will be a global matchmaking in PUBG Mobile, after 3.0 update BGMI and PUBG Mobile global players can play together, and there is a very high probability that the upcoming updates of BGMI and PUBG Mobile may come together on the same day, the server can be changed after every 7th day. In the second features, you will find a fireworks lobby on a spawn island. When you will go on it, an option of fireworks will come on the screen. When you will press it, fireworks will start, you can adjust the night mode by going on emoji option. The third feature is going to be one of the best update of PUBG Mobile 3.0 version. After 3.0 update, you guys can use health kits while driving vehicle. Earlier we can't use even bandages and energy drink while driving. But after next update we can do so. Before we move on to next feature, make sure to hit that like button. And make sure that you subscribe my channel. So moving on to the next update. In the next feature, I will tell you about the new weapon which has been introduced in the game. This weapon is known as Katana. When you will use this weapon, your character will sprint approximately 1 meter for the first time and then it will start slicing the sword. Not only this, you will get an extra button. When you will use it, it will make an ultimate slicing of the sword, which will make a huge damage on your enemies. If you are far from your enemies and you use the sword on your enemies, then also your enemy will deal with the damage. Let's see what will come in the final update. In the fifth feature, I would like to tell you that, a pulley has been added in the new building, which is located in the prison, you can use this pulley to climb the roof, the animation of climbing the pulley is looking great, when the character reaches at the top, the jump animation looks awesome. In the sixth feature, I would like to tell you that, in the prison area a slack line has been added, which can be used to travel from one building to the other building, for this you have to simply climb on the slack line surface and press use button, this feature is also good but up to a limited extent only. In the 7th feature, I will tell you about the new recall system. When you guys get killed by your enemy, you guys directly respawn onto the main island. But in the upcoming update this is completely changed. When you will get killed by someone for the first time, you will respawn on the new island which is located on the bottom side of the Eringal, below Novarepnoi. On this island there will be a pink zone. If you will cross the pink zone, you will get killed and your game will end at that point of time. When you will respawn on this island, you can see the green color smoke coming out from different locations. You have to go near it and activate the button which appears. After that your character will respawn on the main island.